with Fountain Pen Revolution here, and I've gotten a number of emails lately of customers um, wanting to know how to get a feed that is stuck in a section out of a fountain pen. Uh, with a lot of fountain pens, what you can simply do is, is, is if they're friction fit, and most fountain pen uh, nibs and feeds are, you can simply grab the nib and feed and pull them out. Uh, but this is an example of a, a Gamma Supreme handmade fountain pen, and Gamma fits their nibs and feeds really tightly in the section. And so no amount of force that I'm able to uh, muster anyway am I able to pull out the nib and feed merely by force. Now what a uh, professional or a hobbyist would do to remove this nib and feed, of course you take off the uh, the section first, is you would employ the use of something called a knockout block. What you do with a knockout block is you just stick your nib and feed in a hole there and then there's a rod uh, and you can use a hammer to hammer out the nib and feed. But uh, most of us don't have a knockout block, so what do you do if you don't have a knockout block and you've got a stuck nib and feed? Well, I'm going to teach you a way to sort of improvise and remove that stuck nib and feed. What you can do is find a drill bit that's the right diameter to fit into that section behind the feed, and you can sort of improvise a reverse knockout block. The, the, the uh, process is pretty simple. You just insert that drill bit into the back of the section where it meets the feed, and then what I'm going to do, I'm going to do it on a piece of wood so I don't damage my table here, I'm just going to pound this down, essentially making a reverse knockout block. You see I'm just holding the drill bit, the back side, so it's flat and doesn't damage my feed, inserting it against that feed, and I'm just going to pound down. And as I do, see it pushes that feed completely undamaged out of the section and then uh, simply pull out that nib and there you go how to remove a nib and feed that are stuck in a section uh, without needing to have a knockout block thanks for watching